Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to download Bluetooth device driver software on your Windows device. So we're going to be doing this on a Windows 10 machine, but it should also work for Windows 7 and Windows 8 computers as well. So it's going to be pretty straightforward and we're going to jump right into it. And the first thing we're going to do is head over to the start menu and we want to find out what our processor is. So we're going to type in system. Underneath settings, there should be something that says system. Windows 7 and Windows 8 should have an option that also says system. You want to open that up. This will give us additional information about our computer. I'm, I'm sure many of you guys have seen this screen before. Underneath processor, whatever's listed here is what we want to look up. So in our case, we're using an Intel processor. Some of you guys might be using an AMD processor. Those are the two most popular ones on the market. So I recommend just taking note of whatever your processor is right here. And then I'm going to close out of the screen and then I'm going to open up my Microsoft Edge web browser. You can open up any web browser you choose. I'm just going to open up Edge because it's pretty convenient. It's right on my desktop so easy to go. And I'm going to type in Intel Bluetooth driver download. And we should see there's something that says download for Intel Pro Set slash wireless software. And right underneath should say wireless Bluetooth software. You want to select the Bluetooth software link. And this is for my case for Intel. So if we expand all, click on this expand all option here, we can see a little bit additional information. I would recommend that you guys download the most recent version and it should be at the top of the list and we can see that this is for Windows 10 and Windows 7 so you just will click this download button right here which will begin downloading the Intel wireless Bluetooth software if you are using an Intel processor you just will click on this download button right here and it would begin the download And then you would want to download the correct version if you're using a 64-bit or 32-bit version of Windows. So again, you have to make sure you take note of that. I figure most of you guys should have known that, but if we go back into system here, you can double check. I happen to be running a 32-bit version of Windows, but most of you guys should be running a 64-bit. You can see it says 32-bit operating system for me. If it says 64-bit operating system, you need to download the 64-bit one. So I'm going to download the 32-bit one for my case and accept the terms of the license agreement. And once it's done, I'm going to click on save. To save the file should be similar in other web browsers as well. It shouldn't take too long to download here. And once it's done running the security scan, we're going to run this file. If you receive a user account control window, we're going to select yes. It's going to say welcome to the Intel Wireless Tools Installation Wizard. It's going to select next here. It'll begin installing. It's going to select next again. Once you're done reading through the end user license agreement, you can click on I accept the terms of this agreement to proceed to the next step. I'm going to select typical installation here and then I'm going to finish off by clicking on install. Again, this should not take too long. And it says completed the Intel Wireless Bluetooth Wizard setup. Click the finish button to exit the setup wizard. So then at that point, you should be good to go, and I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out, and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.